Hello, penguins and friends. This is an American linden. It has, I'll tell you, it's what it has, its features. How do I know it's an American linden? It has sort of a heart-shaped leaf with kind of a slope here, right? It has a slope where the heart is not the same on both sides. A little sloped shoulder there on the heart. All the leaves are that shape, a heart with a sloping shoulder, an uneven heart. They're all like that and they're all dark on the top side. They get a lot of sun that way, attract the sun, darker colors. And then on the bottom side, it's a pale green. So pale or light green on the bottom and dark on the top. And then in June-ish, it blossoms these white flowers. And then after the flowers are done, it makes these kind of yellow nutlets. I thought that was such a cool word. I wanted to share it with you. These are nutlets. They're not nuts you and I would eat, I don't believe. I'll double check on that, but I'm certainly not going to try today. Uh, but these, they're hard and tiny, tiny. You can see compared to my fingers there, they're very tiny. And right now this doesn't smell too much, but I know from experience the white flowers smell very nice. American Linden has a very nice shape, right? The crown and the little shape of the tree. What is that underneath on the ground? What's that dark patch of ground? Yeah, that's its shadow. And it's kind of right underneath it, right? Like here's the edge of the tree. There's the shadow. And then it doesn't go too far off the other direction. The shadow's kind of right underneath it because friend, it's about two o'clock right after lunch and the sun is pretty much overhead. My question for you, is what will happen as the sun starts to go down? What will happen to its shadow? Will its shadow stay right where it is? Or will the shadow move as the sun goes down today? What will happen to this American Linden's shadow? Much love.